Hello YouTube, I'm back. As of the moment that I'm recording this video, I'm actually not back. I'm actually very annoyed. I ordered my new laptop on October 2nd, I think. Today is October 21st. I still don't have it. UPS seems to not have figured out that I have a job, that someone who would buy a $1,300 computer has a job. I am not in focus. And because they don't seem to have figured that out, they want me to sign for a package when I am at work. So tomorrow I should be able to get the laptop. They are leaving it at the UPS store. It is the next day. Camera's not high enough. She came! I have a laptop! laptops have the same size screen. This laptop is a two-in-one. That's why it comes with a stylus. You can technically flip it over in half and use it as like a touchscreen tablet. I don't really think I'll be getting much use out of that feature because I just really don't care, but it is, it's there. It exists. Ooh. as absolutely riveting as it is to film these clips i want to get acquainted with my new laptop i want to get it set up and i want to edit this very video that you are watching now so i'm gonna go let's head back to the previous clip but yes i got it just wanted to let y'all know i'm excited to come back i just thought i would film a quick hey and let you guys know some of the potential changes that i'm going to make for the channel um, but while we talk about that, I do want to get ready for the night because because I have to freaking go to the UPS store after work. Uh, I got home a little later than usual, so I'm gonna get undressed out of my work attire and get kind of settled in, and then we'll continue the discussion. Or 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 maybe I'll use me changing as Beagle. I'm not really sure. We'll talk about that. We'll talk. We'll, we'll talk, okay? We'll talk. <laughs> Let's talk about some of the changes that I want to make. I've been doing some thinking in my time away, and I've come to the conclusion that I am just not good at being a YouTuber. I have been here for over five years, and I still don't, I haven't even, I don't even have a hundred subscribers each year. You know, like my averages are not good. <laughs> um, my channel is certainly not monetized, nowhere near it, meaning I haven't made a cent. My videos are still not of the best quality. I'm still figuring out basic things like how to set up some lights and make a moody shot. And I think that that's okay. I have decided that maybe being good at this isn't what I'm here for. And although it's what I want, it's not what I need. You know, another thing I want to do is I want to get some roller skates. I want to learn how to skate. I'm probably going to make a video out of it because I make a video out of everything. I want to learn how to roller skate. And what I really would love to see be the outcome of that is me turn into a figure skater and get inline skates and then eventually be ice skating and like triple axling my ass off. But I know myself. I know I'm not very flexible, I know I've never been good at being flexible, I know I've tried to get flexible and haven't really succeeded. I know that I have my strengths and my weaknesses and I know what I'm capable of on my own and it's not that. Okay, I'm not going to be doing any roller skating jumps, turns, none of that. And I will be lucky if I learn how to use the stoppers, honestly. So I think it's worth noting that even though I know I'm not going to be good at it and I know I'm not going to be like the best of the best or even as good as I want to be, I'm still doing it just because I feel like it and I think it would be fun. And I realized that that's what I've been doing with YouTube for the past five years, doing it because I want to and I think it's fun, but also putting that pressure on myself to be as good as I want to be and to be one of the best when that's just not who I am, it's not what I'm capable of, and it's not who I need to be. I don't know if this video is grainy or not. I really hope it's not. Like, it looks so cool in the camera, 
<laughs> in the view that I'm looking at. But I really, really hope it's not grainy for you guys. If it is, I'm gonna put like a little recording thing in the corner and like some, some like make a box with the little white ticks and we're gonna pretend that this is an intentional aesthetic decision. So yeah, I'm, I'm not very good at YouTube. I'm not, if I were good at this, I wouldn't, I wouldn't still be trying to amass enough subscribers to be monetized five years in. Like, I think I would have figured it out by now. I've tried to get back what I'm missing and I've tried to figure it out and I failed in many different ways. And I think it's time to just stop trying to be good at this. Stop trying to make this a stream of income, to stop trying to make this a way to like grow myself online, grow my... The camera won't even focus on me. <laughs> <laughs> Clearly I'm not meant to be doing this. I, I just need to stop trying to make it something that it isn't. And although I still want it to be that, I still want to be a figure skater. I've accepted that that's not gonna happen. And when I buy my skates, I know I can just have fun with it and skate with my friends or by myself and just have a good time. And I think my channel also needs to be that. A place where I can go to just have a good time. I've learned through a lot of my experience. Oh, by the way, I'm in California. I know I made the moving video, never really got to update you guys on that. That is a video that's coming, how I moved across the country with no job and no plan. Uh, stay tuned. <laughs> and through living here, and spoiler alert, things going really well, I've learned a lot. One of the things being that it's okay to fail. You know, um, I kind of made my peace with jealousy a while ago and decided that that's just a human emotion that we all feel and it's it's normal, it's natural, and it's okay and it's just something to be worked through not something to villainize yourself for because you felt it like you're gonna feel jealous at times that's just how this works and I think I'm also starting to accept you're not gonna be the best at everything and you're gonna fail sometimes and you're gonna sometimes have things that you're just not good at and that that's okay and that you don't really have to be good at everything <laughs> it's fine with that being said though, I do kind of want to like play around and I want to have a certain feel about my videos. I don't know what that feel is yet though. I don't know if I want to like have a bunch of b-roll and be like a super, you know, boom boom bam, quick pacing kind of channel or like a super cinematic kind of video person or super chill vlogs like I've been doing that. Those are the kinds of videos I like to watch. So I'm probably still gonna emulate that in some senses, but do I wanna like have like you know, some moody lighting, give it a little Emma Chamberlain, give it a little, um, what's her name? Nicole Raffi, like do I wanna give the girly something? I don't know. So that's what this, it, this this blue light that I turned on and this kind of moody lighting and I get trying that's what this is about I'm gonna be experimenting with different editing styles different music different lighting different filming and just see what I like and see what's fun so if you're seeing things kind of shift around in my channel and you're kind of confused maybe leave a like on the videos that you like so that I can know what's working and know what I'm not good at, but comparatively less bad at compared to everything else I do on this channel. And we can, you know, find ourselves a happy middle ground between the kinds of things that I like to watch, the kinds of things I like to create, and the kinds of things I'm actually capable of creating. I've gained 50 subscribers since posting a couple of shorts. And that doesn't sound like a lot, but considering the fact that before that I had 100 subscribers that I got over the course of five years, and then I gained 50 in three months. Shorts are where it's at. So, um, maybe, no, I'm not even gonna say that. I'm not committing to anything. If I decide to post a short a day, I'll do that. But right now, I don't know what I want shorts to be. Like, I don't have any ideas for shorts. If I was posting a short, I would just be doing it to do it, and I don't really feel like doing that. Like, I got a TikTok for my um, art Etsy, link in the description to kind of try and promote and grow and whatever and I'm just like I don't want to make TikToks like I don't enjoy doing it it's not fun I don't want to do it and I'm in this middle ground of like should I do it to improve the business or should I not do it because I don't want to should I stay true to myself should I try and be a marketer should I try and just be an artist I don't know 
But my YouTube channel doesn't, I don't make any money from this, so I don't have to put it under that same level of scrutiny. And I don't have to commit to posting Vlogmas or doing a short a day or doing, you know, more Christmasy content during Christmas, more Thanksgiving-y content during Thanksgiving and New Year's videos and oh, post the uploading schedule and having good thumbnails. I don't have to commit to anything because I'm just here for fun. I'm just fucking around. So uh, one idea that I want to do is upload once a week pre-film some videos and just get that ready so I can do that, but I'm not committing to that. I'm saying that to you now because it's something I think I want to do, but maybe once I start editing this, I'll be like, actually, I lied. <laughs> I actually completely lied to you, so who knows? You know, I'm not, I'm not tying myself to anything. If you see me posting a short a day in December, okay, but again, I literally don't know what my shorts would be. I have nothing to say. The shorts that I like to watch are people's pets and I don't have any pets so I don't know what shorts I would post. Maybe I just post shorts that are objectively bad because that's what I've been doing. I've just been picking up my camera and filming what I feel like filming for these shorts and those are the ones that gave me 50 subscribers so maybe if I just post really bad shorts that I enjoy, someone else will enjoy them for some reason. That's kind of the moral of the story. I'm here to have fun. I'm not committing to anything. My style is gonna be changing, but I'm still figuring that out. And I'm back. You're seeing this video. I have finally collected my freaking laptop and UPS is no longer the bane of my existence. They're no longer holding my girly hostage. And I have videos coming on please focus why don't you want to look at me is it because i'm am i not illuminated enough do you want this this looks bad camera i need you to understand this looks terrible so if i do this right is that bad can you i don't i don't think i'm in focus and now the lighting's changed so when i do my next jump cut the lighting is going to be different Fucking. Hello! I have some videos coming. I have this one coming. Hi, if you're watching it. I have a video coming on my the lessons that I learned about failure through climbing a mountain. I have a video coming on moving to California with no job, no plan, and like not like tons and tons of savings, so I like needed a job. I have a video coming on my experiences in adult life so far. I have a video coming on me planning and prepping for and participating in uh, my small business's first pop-up shop. And I probably have some other stuff coming, but I'm not gonna verbally commit to anything here because I'm just gonna post what I feel like posting. I've already started filming those videos or finished filming them, which is why I'm telling you that they're gonna happen. But other than that, I will just be doing whatever I feel like doing. And I hope you guys enjoy that. Thank you so much for watching and you know click some other videos. I don't feel like taking like a lot of time to prompt you to click them. Like click them if you want to click them. If you don't, that's fine because I don't want to tell you to click them. So yeah, click them, whatever. It is what it is. I'll see y'all next time. Here I'll be having some fun with my editing. Ah. <laughs> and until then, toodaloo.